just stole my kidney. Um, I did not wake up in a tub of ice. That would be way more exciting than what really happened. But um, I basically, four and a half weeks ago, donated my kidney to somebody who was a complete stranger until a few weeks before the surgery. Um, on April 19th, <laughs> on April 19th, just after 11 o'clock in the morning, I checked in and uh, started surgery at the Mayo Clinic in North Phoenix. They were totally awesome. They were really great people. And um, anyway, three months ago, I never would have known what a kidney does. So what does a kidney do? It filters your blood, and that goes to your bladder, and it makes you pee. So I've talked a lot about pee in the past um, couple weeks. And you have two of them, and some people didn't know that. But you have two of them in the small of your back. and. The kidney that was taken from me was my right kidney, so the one that's left is called Lefty. <laughs> There's names for everything in my body right now. And the first thing that I thought of when I decided to do this was, hot damn, I'm going to lose 20 pounds. <laughs> A kidney only weighs three ounces. <laughs> so I've lost maybe two pounds. But the big deal is, is that kidney disease is one of the most expensive diseases in the United States. 13% of the population, which is equivalent to the state of Massachusetts, has kidney disease in the United States. My surgery alone um, on both ends was about a million dollars. I donated my kidney to somebody that was a complete stranger until a few weeks before the surgery, and she was a friend's mom, and we call her Tiny Mom. Tiny Mom is from India. Um, I like to say she's dot, not feather Indian. <laughs> And I became aware of the problem. <laughs> I became aware of the problem by becoming a fan of my friend Kirti's page on Facebook, which was detailing her mother's kidney disease and um, the progress in her illness and how things were going. And then one fateful day in January, it was a Thursday night, she put on Twitter that her mom was put on a donor list. Um, it would take up to six years to get a kidney, and she would not live that long. So me and my big mouth, <laughs> I'm East Coast, um, I just blurted out, I'll do it. I'll donate my kidney. And uh, so Kirti called me that night and I said, I have two kidneys, you have one mom, let's do it. Um, my father died of cancer, I couldn't help him. So I didn't know that a white person like me could donate to somebody of another color. And um, it doesn't matter because we're all pink on the inside. And it just goes by blood type. <laughs> but what really killed me was because of her kidney disease, um, in order to avoid going on dialysis and stay as healthy as she could, she had to avoid a lot of food for 10 years. And one of the main ones was pizza, potatoes, uh, bananas, anything with potassium in them. So my, step, my testing started on Valentine's Day. And that was one, two, three, four, five, 10 tubes of blood I started with. I've had uh, CT scans, two mammograms, because they found a lump in the first one. And what motivated me through all of this was I finally got to meet Tiny Mom um, in front of TV cameras. Fox 10 came over, and she's an amazing lady. And that is what motivated me through, through all the testing, all the publicity. <laughs> So Valentine's Day was 10 hours in the hospital testing. I peed in four cups. I've given so many tubes of blood. Um, <laughs> and that's what started, and my 40th birthday was two days later. But I couldn't have done it without the support of everybody in the community. And it started with F&B Restaurant uh, doing our first fundraiser. And then Fez. <laughs> And then my friend Yesenia has a Salvadoran restaurant, El Salvadoreño, in uh, Sunny Slope. So we had to come up with a name. Um, we have Tiny Mom, and I've always been fabulous. So um, we kind of put it together and named it Tiny Fab Kidney, put a little bindi on the forehead to personalize it. And on April 19th was the day of our surgery, and the Today Show was there, which aired this morning. And that's Tristan, and he's so cute. And <laughs> Um, that was also at, that was taken in the lobby of the Mayo Clinic, and people asked me all along, you know, what did you get out of this? I didn't get paid for anything, but um, I gained a sister, I gained a new family, and I got this kick-ass green bracelet. <laughs> we do have a website. It's tinyfabkidney.com. 
please become a fan of our Facebook page. And if you're interested in donating, um, please talk to me in the lobby. I got to pee.